today when we were trekking across the island, I, I heard the voice of the man who raped me. What do the voices say? They complain. They endlessly complain. Ellie, can I ask you something? I mean, what was it like never speaking? It was lonely. Oh, Ellie. You know how much I care about you, don't you? Really? <sighs> Did you hear that? No. No, what was it? It was one of the voices. It said that if we keep trekking across the island, we're all going to die. So what do we do? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Who's going to believe me? Ellie, I believe you. GPS, do We're I? lost. No, we're not. How do you know? <sighs> I can feel it. Trust the Christians to get a feeling. Hello? Um, can you help us? We've gotten a tad bit lost. I'm afraid I can't. Siana, soy tu hijo. Quiero que estemos juntos otra vez. How did you know that? What does it mean? You said you were my son and you wanted us to be together again. Who told you that? I guess it was your son. Did you see him? No, but he spoke to me. Who are you? My name's Lily. Frank's wife. What are we gonna do? We need to get to Frank's camp. What is Frank gonna do? We have to help him. Listen to me. Frank saved me. He can heal Nick. 
Okay, let's, let's get him up. Uh, come on, Nick. Uh. Frank, I want to know why I'm in hell. The, oh. <laughs> what is this place? This is not hell. Listen. Wait, you're not the devil? Well, that depends on who's asking. If who's, you think I'm the devil, Brad, then I guess I am. Who's asking? I'm asking you. I want to you. say how proud I am. You found your faith again. Faith? Mm. You want to talk faith? You want to talk faith? What do you know about faith, Frank? I know it's what carried you all the way across this island. You wanted to know why you were saved. Well, I saved you. Saved me? Hmm. Look, I didn't ask to be saved, okay? All I wanted was to see my brother again. And I did. Dead in a boat on this island. And I took the cross from around his neck and I threw it into the ocean. But God didn't save him, did he? But I believe in God. I know that now. Good. Because Ellie showed me. This is what you're looking for, Brad. You're doing good, Brad. You have your father's eyes. You saved Nick. I'm Frank. What are you? I'm an art collector. You are surrounded by illness, Lindsay. You need to be healed. From what? I'm not sick. What is the most important thing in the world to you? My father. You remember the day at the art gallery? That was the last time you ever saw him. You can see him again. There. 1,400 steps. Go. Hello, Nancy. Missed you so much. Thought I'd never see you again. Here I am. I'm sorry for what I did to you. I am. Losing your mother and you is the biggest mistake of my life. The last mistake. You abandoned me. I know. I loved you, Lindsay. I always loved you. I was sick. I was manic depressive. That, that's why I killed myself. I mean, it wasn't you. It was never you. It was never you. Then why did you leave? Do you know how much I blamed myself for that? If I could take back what I did to you, 
I would. God, I would. <laughs> you ruined my life. No, Lindsay. You just have to stop being afraid. I'm not afraid. Yes, you are. You're afraid that if you become a painter like I was, that you'll kill yourself too. But you don't have what I had. You're not sick. Lindsay, you are an amazing painter. I mean, better than I ever was. I know you can do this. You just have to stop being angry and afraid. You have to let go. Yes, you can. Everyone that I love dies. You have to start loving yourself. I know you can do this, Lindsay. But you have to let go. I'm gonna count to five. When I say five, I want you to let, let go of my hand, okay? Okay? One. Two. I love you, Dad. God, I love you too, Lindsay. Three. Nick, I need to talk to you. Have a seat. Am I still dying? No. Why was I dying? Because you're like me. People like us can only survive in the sanctuary. Well, what's the sanctuary? This island is a sanctuary. Did you heal Lindsay too? Yes, I play the music. Well, what's that? The music. The music sends memories through time between people's minds. You can only send them back to people who cared about you. People like you and me. We're the only ones who can send the music. Are you a god? Well, some people call me a messenger. What did you do? I met with your parents. And? And we had tea. <laughs> Look, I, I want I want to know why I was dying. We spent so much time away, Nick, from the sanctuary. The part of you that was a messenger was killing the human part of you. But you're here now. You're here now. Yeah, and what am I, what am I doing here? You're a messenger, Nick. You're a messenger. Don't you see what I'm saying to you? 1,000 years I have lived on this island, watching Earth. I watched you being born. I was in the room at your birthdays. I was in the wind with the sailboat. 
wasn't the applause for your graduation. I'm moving the green of Lindsay's eyes, Nick. You and I are closer than you know. Look, I, um, I know that this, this virus, it's, it's not... This us. virus is not of this realm. Yeah, yeah. Then what is it? it where, do, where does it come from? Millions of years ago, our civilization came to Earth and seeded it with life, knowing eventually life would evolve into human beings. We gave you a chance. We let you evolve, and now all these years later, you're just a primitive race. Uh, wait a second. You so much evolution. I mean, you could put a man on the moon, the internet. You could map out the t entire universe, but you couldn't coexist on the same planet. Now, I was sent here by the elders to judge your species, the species we created. And we were gravely disappointed. Your moral evolution has drifted off course. Your race calls it a sin? We call it a defect. And that defect had to be fixed. So we decided to wipe everything out and start all over again. Take life right back to the beginning. And we chose six of you, all of you survive and repopulate the earth and it's no coincidence those six people are the people you care about the most you killed my parents oh no, they're not your parents I'm your father What do you want me to do? You must learn to surrender. I thought Frank was the devil. And why did you want to talk to him? Because I let my brother die. And I'm going to hell. He went out into the ocean and I didn't even stop him. He was only 15 and I'm the reason he's dead. Close your eyes, Brad. Why? Just close them. When I saw your brother on the beach, he spoke to me. He told me something. What? What did he say? He said he forgives you.
Nick. Are you ready to let her go? <laughs> Why would I do that? Because it is time. You've got to let her go and play my role. Play your role? Yes. Play... <laughs> What's, what exactly is going to happen if well, I do that? Well, you can that? forget about happiness. Oh, for, forget... <laughs> Let me tell you something. I, I've been dying almost my entire life, and the one person, the one person that I cared most for in this world has never cared for me yes. back. So I think it's a little safe to say I've never known happiness. You're right. You are right, and you are left. God, what, what the hell does that even mean? What does anything really mean? What am I? I'm a gardener. Gardener. I'm a harvester. I, you harvest, har you know what you harvest? You harvest souls. You, you killed everybody. Yeah. Millions of people, you didn't stop till you wiped out every damn thing on this planet. You killed everybody. Nick, everything that has happened in your life up until now, all of the doctor's visits, the sleepless nights, the coughing, the blood, it all has Worth, okay? Worth. It's how you got to this point. Do you understand that? You have got to make a decision. Now you can remain as you are. Or become as I am. As okay? you are. The great I am. Become a as, you, as you are? You're telling me you're, you're my father? That, that, that you're in the applause at my graduation? Okay, yeah. let's cut the rhetoric. Okay, you know what time it is? What? It's get real time. It's get real time. Yes. Yeah, it is. You get real! You! You get real! You're telling me you're, you're in the, the, the wind of the sailboat that you, you had on my birthday but You were never there. You were never there. That, that you're in the, you move in the green of Lindsay's eyes. You know what you are? You're a manipulator. That's what you did. You manipulated me. You manipulate everybody. That's what you do! Let's get a shovel. What for? Let's... Start digging this cold, hard ground, son. We are right here. We are at the line, man. And all we've got to do is step off. It's like the hawk. Did you see the hawk? What? It's got this little nest right up there in the tree. And all the little babies are there. And they're eating. And they're feeding. And they're growing. And eventually, the mother will just push them right out of the nest. And they have to fly. And they can fly. And if they don't, they fall. They die. Jesus. Now, Jesus has nothing to do with this. What does this say? What? Who does Lindsay care about? Her, her dad, but he's From your heart, Nick. Speak. Charlie. Yeah. She's not into you. When you're older, you will understand. You're not ready. Wait. <clears throat> Dad. Look at me. Look. I'm up for it. I'm up for it. I don't buy it. I'm up for it! Lay out your hands, palm up. What are you doing? Take a breath. Close your hands. Close your eyes. <laughs> 